Hello, good people. My name is Rick Astor. Thank you for joining me for your new moon intention setting for the new moon and solar eclipse of June 10th, 2021. Usually I suggest to set new intentions for every new moon, but this eclipse is in some ways an echo of the eclipse of June 2020. So if there's anything you left incomplete a year ago when we had the solar eclipse at the summer solstice in the northern hemisphere. Now would be a good time to revisit that and do further work because time is more connected at these eclipse moments. I'll start with a theme card from the Untold Truths of the Heart Oracle. The card is Hoping. So there is something you're hoping for that would deserve your attention at this new moon. Now remember, the best intentions are the ones that come within you, so take the parts of this reading that fit with what your, your heart is calling for. Just ignore the other parts. I'll be drawing cards from the Light Seer's Tarot. And this card flipped over, so we'll start here. This is the Hanged Man as the situation. For the Obstacle, the Five of Cups. The Marketplace Position, the Hermit in Reverse. Thoughts, the Knight of Pentacles in Reverse. Feelings, judgment in reverse. And the outcome, the Queen of Cups in reverse. So to start out with, there is definitely something to think about here. And I say that because we have the Hanged Man, we have the Hermit, the Knight of Pentacles suggests that things will stop and wait while you look things over. And then the Five of Cups is the obstacle that is suggesting that something happened that it was a disappointment or there was a loss. So you want to stop and think about what was lost, how to respond. Judgment is a card that points to the past, but in reverse, it too is saying that this is not the time to resolve something in a final way because there is a lot you don't know. In the outcome position, the Queen of Cups in reverse, especially when it's next to Judgment in reverse, suggests that there is some drama ahead or some surprises at least. This seems to say to expect the unexpected. It also says don't expect things to stay the way they are now or the way they are in the next few days. There are more changes, more surprises on the way. Let me get a few more cards to clarify, and I'll start with this judgment in reverse. Why do we have the judgment in reverse? So this is the Page of Swords. So Page of Swords is a message, it's information. Judgment is in reverse because we're going to get more information in the not-too-distant future. Now let me look at the Hermit. The Two of Pentacles. So part of the reason we need to stop and think is that there has been so much going on we're juggling so many things, and we may need to slow down and take a look at what's really going on, where we are. And now, the Five of Cups is the obstacle. What kind of loss or disappointment was this that we're trying to deal with? Is this something that's happened already, or is it something that's about to happen? I'm getting the Three of Pentacles. 
So something to do with work or study or way of thinking. It seems to me that there's information or there's strategies that we got from other people that have not proved adequate to what we're looking at. We look at the world and we say, this is not helping very much. The overall story I'm getting here is that things have not gone the way that we were told. We need to slow down, take a careful look at things, and prepare for more big changes ahead. And these are changes that we probably can't understand very well right now. So let me get a guidance card. This will be another oracle card. The card is Heart Song. So this says to pay attention to your intuition, but pay attention also to your desires. Even though we may not know all the details of what's going on in the world, we can kind of tell where it's leading us and where we want to go given these circumstances. And that may be the best thing to pay attention to at this point. So I hope this could give you some ideas, some thoughts about what you might choose as your new moon intention for this new moon. I would say even more so than usual to give some careful thought to your new moon intentions and good luck in turning them into actions and results during this moon.